Hey, it's Luke at Whiskey Run, and welcome to hole number three of the serpent course, known as Serpent's Tail. The massive serpent pond really comes into play on this third hole. From the blue and white tees, you'll have to carry the water off your tee shot. The pond runs all the way along the left-hand side, and on your approach shot, be sure not to fly the green as there's a creek behind it. Now let's go play it together. Now you can do a couple of things here. You can take the big stick out and try to get it up close to the green, or you can play it safe with an iron, which is what I prefer to do. Let's put it in the middle of the fairway. So we tried to play the safe route, hit the iron off the tee, and look how close we came to the water. Real close to the water, not a fun spot. And also when you're out here on the serpent, you gotta be careful that you don't get too close to the water because the serpent might get you. Now we have a threat level detector on the serpent. If that stick right over there, you can see we're at threat level green, which means it could be anywhere. <gasps> what was that? Did you hear that? Serpent could be anywhere. Be careful out here. Watch where you're going. Don't go in the water. Remember to replace your divots. Now we avoided going into the water off the tee. Plus, we're on in two, double plus. Got a putt for birdie. Let's see if we can make it. And remember, fix your ball mark. Beautiful. Now we were able to get our par, but if you're lucky enough to grab your birdie here on number three of the Serpent, stop into the pro shop, come see us, grab your birdie chip, because you just joined the birdie club. Come on down to Whiskey Run and let me know how you did on number three of the Serpent course, known as the Serpent's Tail.